if you guys haven't been keeping up with my social media, I will be attending the following cons for this summer. MomoCon in Atlanta, Georgia, Acon in Fort Worth, Texas, Anime Expo in Los Angeles, California, and Anime Con in Helsinki, Finland. So I hope to see you guys there this summer. Hey friends, it's Aki Dears, and today Mama Aki is in the kitchen today about to cook something wonderful for myself. I would cook it for you beautiful peeps if you were here and if you could all fit in my house. So today I'm going to be making a giant jello thing of gudatama. I haven't made gelatin since I was in kindergarten, so in a way I'm kind of starting on a fresh slate here and I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not going to say that this is what you need. This is all just improvisation for me. So I've got a cake pan which will act as the base for the white part of gudetama. This bowl is going to be the yolk part, and it's going to be mixed in with a bit of pineapple jello and peach jello. Some regular gelatin, but I also found these frozen special gelatin which is like summer berry peach flavored. Best 7 out of 10 anime according to IGN. <laughs> Just pour that whole thing in there. So as you can see, you really need to make the jello dissolve really well in hot water. So as you can see, you really need to make the jello dissolve really well in hot water. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of milk just for the color. Now I'm just gonna put this in the fridge. Now, we hope and pray. Now I'm going to make the yolk part of Gudetama using this bowl. I look like I'm running a crack house. This video is going to be a disaster. I have no confidence in myself. Does this have color to it? I, I really can't tell. I really hope it does. It looks very white and light pink. So I really hope it turns out as vibrant as it does on the box. Mix both those colors together. Ooh, there's like a really nice aroma of peach and pineapple put together. <gasps> it's magic! <laughs> ha! I'm barefoot! Uh. Now I know it looks green, but I think it's just because the bowl is blue. And I added yellow. <laughs> gently, gently. Oh, it's very, very peach. And if anything, this color is very accurate to Japanese eggs because I know that they're much more orange. Baby number three. They're gonna be so cute when they grow up and they're gonna taste delicious. And now here comes the fun part. We wait. How long are we supposed to wait? Like an hour? Four hours. <laughs> I love Gugatama. I love Gugatama. He is cooking in the fridge. He is cooking in the refrigerator with his babies to come very soon. Welcome to Aki Cook Let's Plays, everyone. This guy doesn't suspect a thing. He's like, you know what? I've been hit by a couple of arrows, but I'm just gonna take a nap. Wrong choice. I feel there is something above me. I'll camouflage here. Maybe he can't see me. I can see you. All right, I'll be back in a quick transition, guys. Finally, it's been four hours. So now time to take the gelatin out of the fridge. Ow! Okay, this is the egg white part. That that feels okay. Oh my gosh, it actually turned out pretty all right. I don't know if it's gonna taste as good as it looks. And then the yolk part. I'm gonna work on this first. So moment of truth. To take it out. <laughs> now we're at an impasse. I have nothing this big. So I'm gonna use this bed and breakfast table and I'm just gonna cover it with napkins. I think that will, yeah, that's a perfect fit. God said, let there be gelatin. Eh? What? Oh no. Wait. It's a little stuck, but I got this. Just a tad bit stuck. Oh, crap. Ah! No! Maybe I can't take it out. Well, will this one come out? It didn't work! <laughs> I'm gonna do my best to mold this. This was supposed to look like a clean, beautiful egg. I'll try adding a face to see if we can get some kind of good tama to come out of this. So I'm putting some seaweed on to do some type of justice to put a face on him. He just kind of looks like the drawing board for good tama. Maybe we have better luck with the babies? They're just gonna be yoked too. <laughs> so I have a bowl of rice here. I think I'm supposed to put something hot on this. 
That looks a lot better because there were some chunks coming out of it, but that's a lot better than Big Mama. So we have Baby and Big Mama. Please, I have so much to live for. In my stomach. No! Why has the Dark Lord forsaken me? Stop, brother. No, what? This is our fate as eggs. No, it can't be. Listen to him. We're off to a bigger, better world out there. No, there must be something we can do. Be all right, my son. Everything will be okay. This is our duty as eggs. Be a good Gudetama and make your mother proud. Mmm! It's so sweet! I'm gonna have such a huge sugar rush. Mainly in the white part. The pineapple and peach one isn't all that bad. It's like regular jello, but this one that I concocted is like, it's gonna give me such a big sugar rush. Now, sometimes I have my eggs with ketchup, so I got strawberry syrup. I don't know how strawberry syrup is with this. Look at her. Look at her! rice here so I know that jello and rice is just not a very wise combo to make. Let's go. That's nasty. I think the most unexpected taste was when I took some of the seaweed which is only this big. It's really really small but that packed a bad punch and the texture of the rice and the sweetness of the jello did not mix. I'm having flashbacks to the time I did a disgusting bento challenge with Joey. Uh... In Japan, it's good to have a raw egg on top of rice with soy sauce, but I don't know how this is gonna end up. I already know. It's gonna taste nasty. I already can't deal with the jello with the rice. There it is. All right, your last moment of truth. reflex my body told me stop right there what the hell are you doing you are not putting that in your body it couldn't even reach to the back of my throat the moment it hit my taste buds I nasty I'm done there are Filipino hot dogs here but sorry Filipino hot dogs that are going to cleanse my palate after that crap because uh, that was so I'm just gonna do my outro here guys uh, if you want to do the Gudetama jello challenge or whatnot and it turns out a lot better than mine send pictures to my Twitter or my Instagram I'd love to see your guys's concoctions of how you made it or you know however else you make Gudetama so I appreciate you guys for watching and subscribe to my channel for more anime and talk related content oh uh, and I'm actually dizzy did it taste that bad that I'm getting dizzy and I will see you guys in the next video all 10,000 taste buds that's a 10. Bye!